get amused, it's just the news. The mayor of Paris will be unveiling the Star Train huh? right here at the Gare du Nord train station. This ultra-modern train will travel between France and the UK at record speeds, faster than flying by plane. But how is the train going to cross the sea between France and the UK, Marinette? Well, there's a tunnel under the English Channel, Tiki. Did a superhero do that? <laughs> no, just regular men with machines. I can't believe how many inventions humans have made since I last had an owner. There's no stopping progress, Tiki. There's no stopping you, either. This is gonna be a wonderful sweater. It's a tradition, you know. I always knit my dad a sweater every year for his birthday. So I want to do something extra special for him this time around, but I couldn't think of anything. I'm sure you'll come up with the perfect idea. You always do. Well, I'd better think of it now, because his birthday is today. Come on now. It really is a shame, Roland. It's your son's 40th birthday today, and it, uh, ow, I know how much Tom would love it if you... Uh, oh. Is that my grandfather again? Yes. So he's definitely not coming then. I did everything I could. It would have made your dad so happy. He doesn't talk very openly about his feelings, but I know he's sad that he doesn't see his own father anymore. It's a shame. I'd really like to meet him someday, too. He hasn't left his home or seen a single person for over 20 years. I know, but well, why not? Uh, uh, he's a little old-fashioned. In his ways, he's not exactly what you'd call modern. But what happened 20 years ago? Uh, well, it's complicated. If you really want to know more about it, you should probably ask your dad. Hey, Dad, why hasn't Grandpa left his house in 20 years? Oh! Uh, well, because he's very fond of tradition, and, uh, if you want to know more about it, you should probably ask Grandma. Mm, oh, he's always lived in the past. Well, it's complicated. If you really want to know about it, you should probably ask your dad or your mom. Oh, okay. Thanks, Grandma. See you tonight. Ugh, seriously? Why won't anyone just answer me? Judging by that look on your face, I'm thinking you've come up with your idea. You're right, Tiki. I know exactly what I'm getting for my dad for his birthday. I'm gonna get him and his dad back together again. I found Roland Dupin's address. Let's go! What are you waiting for, Marinette? If I tell him who I am right away, he won't listen to me, just like with Mom. What do you want? Uh, I'm a friend. I don't have any friends. This won't be easy. What do you want? Hello, sir. It's the mail lady. Do what you usually do. Throw the mail in the trash. <sighs> what do you want? It's for the firefighter's calendar? <laughs> uh, toss it in the fire. I hate calendars. There's no use. It's hopeless. Come on, that's not the marinette I know, giving up so easily. What do you want? Your flowers here, Mr. Dupin. Oh, come in, come in. It's okay. Hello, I'm Marinette, Mr. Dupin's granddaughter. I was just about to go in myself. You can leave me the sack. I'll bring it to him. It'll be a nice surprise. Roland has a granddaughter? He sure does. <laughs> I should probably help you. Oh, no, it's light. Can I borrow your cap? I want to play a prank on Grandpa. Hmm. Say hi to Roland for me. I'll grab my cap next time I come by. You sure you should be sneaking in, lying, and pretending to be someone else? You've never met your grandfather. You don't know how he'll react. Well, it's not exactly a lie. After all, I am actually delivering the... Oh, yeah! The flower! What really matters is that he comes to Dad's birthday party and that they both make up. Hi, Tiki. Put the sack down in the usual place, you bear. Whoa! Ugh. Uh, where's his usual place? You're not Gilbert. No, I'm uh, Germaine, his cousin. Hmm. Aren't you a bit young to be delivering flour? I'm an intern. <laughs> I'm doing a flower delivery internship because someday I want to own my own flower shop. Hmm. It's good to be ambitious. You can put the sack down now. Have a nice day. Salt. So you're a baker then, huh? 
Are you a flower delivery girl or a nosy detective? Go on, put the bag down and be on your way. That oven you have there, it's a 72 Le Pignol, right? It's a rare wood-fired model. Huh? They only made a few hundred of them. How did you know that? My daddy, uh, uh, my bready bread history teacher taught us that. Well, that's new. You need bread history classes to become a flower delivery person now? You bet. You have to study for 10 years to be a delivery person these days. Well, good luck with your internship, Germain. Now put the sack down and have a good day. That's a weird-looking computer you've got there. A computer? In my house? Are you insane? That's a TV! Really? But is it still working? Nope. Turned it on one day and poof, stopped working. It probably doesn't meet cable standards anymore. We just watch everything on the internet now. The internet is just as crazy as cordless telephones. That's not how it's done. How can sound and pictures go through if there aren't any wires? Simple. They're sent in waveform to relay antennas, which are connected to satellites. It's awesome. You can talk and see anyone you want anywhere in the world. I don't need to speak to anyone. And besides, that's not how it's done if you want to talk to someone. Now put this act down and leave me alone. I've got work to do. Do you live alone? Do you have any family? <laughs> you really are a nosy detective. Don't touch a thing, put the sack down, and leave. No! <laughs> oh, nice bread dough! Hey, no, don't touch that! That's not how don't it's... Don't worry, I know how it's done. You take the dough and fold it in half, rhythmically, pressing it flat, snapping, snapping it slightly. slightly. Oh. Uh. It gives it elasticity and develops the gluten in the dough, so that it holds together well after it's been baked. You're just a schoolgirl reciting a lesson. You don't really know how it's done. I do know my stuff. Maybe even better than you, old man. Better than me. Better than me. Better than me? Charlotte? Marie-Louise? Marguerite? Hey, didn't you hear that? <laughs> better than me? <laughs> we'll see about that. Get into position. Jermaine, we're going to make some bread together. Then we'll see who's the baker and who's only good for delivering flour. <laughs> See this yeast? It's been grown for over 2,000 years by my family, ever since my indomitable ancestor, Lofemix the Gaul, who used to make bread in a small Armorican village, fell alongside Vercingetorix. To be precise, he was my great 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 grandfather. But the Romans won. Puff! And started putting vegetables and cheese on the bread. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now it's pizza. <laughs> you like pizza? You like pizza? You, Jermaine, like pizza? Yes, I do. Oh, she likes pizza. Oh, but that's not how it's done. You don't put cheese and tomatoes on bread dough. It's just like my son and his wife who got it into their heads that adding rice to the dough would make the inside of the bread lighter. That's not how it's done! But what if it's really yummy? Have you ever tried your son's bread? <laughs> no need! I already know it's not going to be good. Making bread with rice flour. That's not uh, how it's done! Well, I think it's creative. How? So, your son's a baker then? I don't have a son anymore. Not since he betrayed me. What, just because he put rice in the bread dough? That's not how it's done! If my bread comes out tasting as good as yours, will you agree to do just one thing for me? Why? What do you want me to do? Are you a baker or a nosy detective? Ha! Your bread won't be as good as mine anyway. Song. It's the song my son and I used to sing when we were needing dough. There's no way you could know that song. Uh, unless, unless you're... Uh, no, that, that's impossible. Oh, yes, I'm your granddaughter, Marinette. You're my granddaughter? <laughs> Liar! I don't have a granddaughter! Betrayal! Deceit! It's just like adding new ingredients to bread! Deceptive! That's not how it's done! Shoo! Get out! Get out! Out with the liar! No! I'm not leaving! Not until you've tasted my bread! You promised you would! Oh, you want to stay here? Stay here then! 
Whether you like it or not, you are my grandfather. And today is your son's birthday. Don't you want to see him again? I can't hear anything. La, 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 la. Don't look at me like that. She shouldn't have lied to her grandfather. I mean to her not grandfather. And her bread. I bet her bread is as terrible as her fart. Hmm. I can smell the bread that's being baked with flames of fury. A perfect recipe for my akumas. Fly away, my little akuma, and evilize him! That's not how it's done by the Dupin, the proud descendants of Lofamix the God. Bakeries. I am Hawkmoth, and I see that you're hungry for power. Well, I'm giving you the ability to serve punishments to anyone who doesn't do things like they should be done. Oh, of course! Would you like a butter croissant or a baguette to go with that? No. In return, I want the miraculous of Ladybug and Cat Noir, two offenders who don't know how it's done. So show them. You can count on me, Hawkmoth. There is no grandpa. I'm Baker X, and anyone who doesn't do things the way they should be done will be served my indomitable wrath. Soon, Paris will look like it did before the modern world took over! Grandpa! <laughs> <laughs> any noise well because it's a modern bus it runs on electricity an electric bus that's not how it's done buses make noise they run on gas and spew out stinky black smoke away with modern buses <laughs> what's all this there's a flying superman girl in paris now yep girl and superhero you gotta get with the times that's not how it's done it's up to the police or the army to carry out law enforcement, not you! Just minutes before the unveiling of the ultra-modern Star Train, I've been told that a super gall is wreaking havoc right here in Paris. I'm going to read Paris of all this modern nonsense, starting with you! <laughs> well, technically, I'm not actually all that modern. My miraculous is from ancient times! Well, we didn't have superheroes in my youth! <laughs> There will be no superheroes in my Paris! Ah! Looks like Ladybug's the one unveiling a brand new method of air transport. Flag, on down! Ah! Don't worry, m'lady, I'm right here. Thanks, Cat Noir, but girls don't always need to be saved by boys. You think I'm a tad old-fashioned, don't you? Oh, I've seen worse than you. Just wait till you meet Baker X. <laughs> Thanks, Andre. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, I'm filming you. Ah! Telephones are for telephoning, not for filming! That is not how it's done! Uh, hey, that's censorship! Just like the good old days. Oh! Oh! An Egyptian pyramid in the king's court? But that's not how it's done! <laughs> A blending of ancient and modern. I personally like this glass pyramid a lot. It's proof that you can be modern and still respect the past. Treachery! Treason! I think we'd better destroy that flask of his. Right. That's probably where the Akuma is, too. Huh? You're out of your league. You don't have enough experience! Save your cataclysm. We're probably gonna need it. Emergency exit! Good eye. What's that? A train that goes underwater? Is it a train or a submarine? That's not how it's done! If you want to go to England, you take a boat! 
poof, you get seasick. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I've got bad news for you. This train is out of service. <laughs> Because it's on its way to the wrecking yard! <laughs> you should ask Queen Bee for some help. We're doing okay for now. Tomatoes in a bottle? Mm, I doubt our friend will take too kindly to this. That's what I'm counting on. In fact, I'm planning to give our baker friend the least traditional sandwich possible. <laughs> Got it. How about some super sour candy chews, plus some super chemical chewing gum, all between two slices of white industrial bread. Oh, stop it, Ladybug. You're making us all drool. Isn't that right, Baker X? I'm not falling for your stupid little tricks. Okay, in that case, I'll just add some tomatoes in a bottle. Mm, now the sandwich is gonna taste like pizza. It's gonna be so good. That's not how traditional sandwiches are done. That's how we do it anyway. No more evil doing for you, little Kuma. Time to see evil eyes! Gotcha! Bye-bye, little butterfly. Miraculous Ladybug! My bread! I left some bread baking in the oven, and my granddaughter's there! It's dangerous! It could catch fire! I'm sure your granddaughter's got it under control. I must get home! I'll take him back, milady. I've got more time left than you. Thank you, Cat Noir. Bug out! <laughs> Are you sure you want to go home on a superhero's back? It's fast, but not very traditional. When bread is at risk, that's how it's done. <laughs> One day or another, things will change, Ladybug. And front row seats to your downfall will sell like hot cakes. <laughs> Marinette! Marinette! Grandpa? Cat Noir? Is everything okay? Uh, yes. I was just scared the bread might be overbaked. <laughs> it looks all right. You see, I do know how it's done. Well, if it's all good, I'll be on my way. No, wait. We need a judge to determine which of these loaves is the best. Uh, the thing is, I'm gonna transform back soon and... Whoa! You're a real tough cookie even without your superpowers. <laughs> Mmm, both these breads are delicious. Do you have any jam by any chance? That's, That's not, not how you taste bread! bread. They're both tasty, in different ways. This one's more traditional, and this one has a delicate flavor that makes it special. It's too hard to choose. I'm sorry, but I really do have to get going. Thanks for the tasty snack. Mmm, this 
right. This flavor is, is really good. I did it the way my dad does it. But how? I added rice to my dough while you weren't looking. You can never have just one bite. So now can I ask you to do that one thing? Will you come home with me? We're celebrating Dad's 40th birthday tonight, and I'm sure he'd be so happy to see his dad. You're not a traditional granddaughter, Marinette. And you know what? I like it. <laughs> Roland? Happy birthday, Dad.